What's going on, everybody? See here. Welcome back to some more Planet Crafter. This episode, we are going to be checking out a couple of things. Um, there is an underground base that we haven't checked out yet. And we did actually unlock our tier two food grower. So that's going to be super exciting. We're going to get some of those built. Um, and then, yeah, I think maybe we'll get to the tree spreader. I'm not positive. I think we're close. So, um, yeah, we'll have to see. But hopefully you guys enjoy. If you do like, subscribe, all the fun things. Also, um, I wanted to let everybody know that we are going to well we i i uh, i went ahead and i actually made some little quick tips videos on basic on uh, finding like basic resources so you're gonna be seeing those come out over the next few days uh while they're not necessarily like you know super exciting content rich kind of videos they're more for um you know for for searching and so people have you know, a, uh, a quick video that if they're looking for something, you know, hopefully to find. So you will be seeing those come out again. They're they're just they're super quick videos. So I know I know they're super quick videos. I'm sorry, but that was kind of the whole point of them. So you're going to be seeing those come out over the next few days. And yeah, pretty exciting stuff. Also, yeah, yeah, yeah. We have all. Yeah. Mm. OK. All right. That's all I'm going to say. <laughs> so uh, we're going to go ahead. We're going to get some fertilizer made up here. And then I actually want to go ahead and test. Um, I want to see what the differences between the tier ones and the tier twos are exactly. Because, I mean, like, it, oh, shoot. Why did I replant those? I don't know why I replanted those. Uh, I replanted them. I don't know. <laughs> it is a thing. It is a thing. So let's go ahead and let's get all our beans out here and there. Okay, fantastic. So food grower tier two requires water fertilizer. So let's go ahead and let's go grab some water to start with because... I am always terrible. See, I'm terrible about collecting water. I'm just, I'm awful about it. So I feel like maybe I should get another one of those going because of just like how bad I am at collecting water. Uh, let's go ahead and throw these in there. Let's grab some uranium, throw those in there. Iridium, we got some of that. We got some osmium, awesome. Uh, we also need to go check on our, um, we need to go check on our drills so we can get some more of this stuff plant volness we're gonna go throw that in our plant storage deal over here but uh yeah i gotta say a huge thank you for uh, everybody who's been sorting the videos uh it's been a fantastic time i've really been enjoying and i've been reading the comments about uh other games that we need to to play so we're we are going to make a return to no place like home so i highly recommend checking out those videos uh let's see actually you know what we need the super alloy for these okay so in order to make sulfur or for fertilizer we need algae sulfur and eggplant so let's go start off by grabbing some algae uh sulfur i'm hoping i have a little bit of sulfur in our in our drill all right so let's go ahead and make some fertilizer we do actually already have some fertilizer ready to go so that is super handy dandy go ahead and grab that one we'll grab another one Pretty sure I only had three sulfur. Uh, let's see. Do we have any more water bottles done yet? You know what? We should really build the lake collector. Uh, where is that water collector for the lake? So three bio nugs, a magnesium aluminum, and a super alloy. Oh, well, I think we can totally do that. I think we've got the bio nugs. We really haven't had to make any. Oh, we only have two. Okay, hold on. What do we need for a bio nug? Two mushroom silicon and a water bottle um oh there's another sulfur right there actually let me grab that i'll make that too uh let's see two mushrooms silicon and a water bottle yeah we're gonna make the lake water collector because that might that's gonna be a little bit quicker okay we're gonna craft up our first bio nug here that's kind of funny i can't believe we made it this far without having to craft any of those things okay and then over here let's put our lake water collector so then hopefully open. Oh yeah, that holds a whole bunch too. Okay, cool. Awesome. So that's there. Now we have the stuff for some food growers. Let's go and get some food growers in here. So these are tier twos and you can tell cause they have two vents. There's a vent on either side. So let's go ahead and let's center the first one so we'll do that and then i'm gonna go actually hit ahead and take this uh take wait what why can't i take that one down we're gonna take that one down and we're gonna place this oh wait are they no okay yeah it has double the vents all right so we've got tier one tier two oh this one 
like you can see the soil all the way down to the bottom okay so that's super neat though. now it says it's double the speed so let me grab uh let's grab eggplants two eggplants now i can't do these exactly at the same time i'm sorry but we can do them close all right so growth speed 0.6 growth speed 1.0 it's not double the speed this is 0.6 this is 1.1 it would be 1.2 if it was double but it is requiring 30 this require 15 oh so it's almost basically exactly the same growth 32 31 okay i like how it starts off at 30 percent 33 32 Okay, so we're gonna let those go. Um, we're obviously gonna build more tier twos because like tier twos are always better than tier ones. Uh, but we're gonna leave those sit for a little bit. And then, you know what? Should I just go ahead and get some more food grower tier twos? Yeah, let's just go ahead and place some more right now. Okay, so we got a couple more food growers in here. Let's grab, we're still good on the bean. You know what, let's, let's grab the beans. We need a little bit of regular food anyways. Uh, did we, oh, I just threw this into storage, didn't I? <laughs> I, I placed them the wrong way. All right. So there's a bean growing. There's a bean growing. All right. Perfect. Go ahead and put those away and yeah, we'll just go and put all this stuff away. All right. So now let's go ahead and let's grab a food and then we're going to take a water to go. And then we're going to go explore another underground base. I don't know how I missed it. But I definitely missed it. I don't know how. Um, it's actually like right over here in this desert area. <laughs> oh, I think we flew right past it at one point. Or maybe it's under the water now. I'm not actually sure. I saw it when I was recording a, uh, a quick tips video. So we'll have to see where it's at. Hey, it's right here. Okay. So this guy. Let's see, learn a new blueprint. Hey, the tree spreader. Our ship has crashed for unknown reasons on this planet. Many of us died on impact. Some of us died on the surface. I'm the only one left. I tried to survive, but this land is too hostile. My health is getting low. I'm going outside one last time to try to find some water. Not great. Not great. Um, oh, a whole bunch of goodies. Okay, well, we'll snag that. Deconstruct that. Any other secrets in here? I don't see any other secrets. Okay, so this one was a little bit uh, less exciting than the other ones that's fine that's fine all right so let's head back <laughs> super secret underground base found uh let's see so that's one two three was over in that one weird area i want to say there's one more secret under oh my gosh it is so dark i want to say that there's one more secret underground base um it feels like everybody's been telling me that there's four of them so we'll have to check that out. Also, chips, I don't think. No more blueprints to decode for now. Hey, at least it says something now. Uh, we'll go ahead and throw that in there. <laughs> Our storage is getting so full of everything. Oh, uh, we've got the overflows. We've got everything going here. All right. Inventory is nice, clean, and clear. Looking good. Let's go ahead. Let's get our first tree spreader, shall we? Uh, that's going to make a bunch of biomass for us, which is amazing. 85 biomass for that bad boy. All right, so tree spreader. We need super alloy, bacteria sample, fertilizer, tree bark, bio nug. Okay, so bacteria, fertilizer, and a bio nugget. Okay, so we found a bio nugget. <laughs> uh, so actually, we have fertilizer. We've got the bio nugget. We've got the tree bark. What else was needed? Bacteria sample and a super alloy. Okay, so bacteria sample, I think, is what? three of those and then three water easy enough so there's our bacteria sample now just a super alloy and then we can get that built and then we get a craft oh my gosh we get to craft our very first tree this is exciting uh overflow check the overflow first so let's go ahead and let's get our trees out in this area here somewhere so like the cool trees i kind of want those towards the middle oh holy moly wait what what am i missing nothing can this not go here what is going on here
It's gotta be on water. Huh? Insert a tree seed in this girl. Place on a water surface. What? So we're growing trees around lakes and stuff. Okay, so let's get this one. Right there. All right, so let's get the coolest trees. Oh, the golden. We got to do the golden one. So I did see a comment saying that there is actually a golden tree seed. Uh, that if you put the golden one in there, that you can research it. And it actually does work. So we're going to start with that one because that one's going to be our big one. Uh, show DNA recipes. Okay, so tree bark, a mutagen. Oh, that's right. We're going to need mutagen now. So we're going to need bacteria sample, water and algae again. Oh, this is going to be exciting. This is the first time we're messing with the mutagen. Uh, you take those. So we need methane and sulfur, which we have both in here. There's methane. I don't know if I left a thing of sulfur in here. Apparently not. Which means that I'm actually out. All right, first mutagen. Let's go. So now, mutagen, golden seed, and was it a tree bark? Okay. Uh, actually, we have tree bark down in here. Is it in tree bark, mutagen, and then plant? Okay, so tree bark, mutagen, that, research. Tree seed, plum, start sequencing. Oh my gosh. So in order to make this, or is it making it right now? I think it's making it right now. Oh wow, that actually takes a minute, doesn't it? We're at 5%, holy moly. Well, I guess while that's doing that, what do we need for another tree spreader? <laughs> Bacteria sample, tree bark, bio nug. Oh my gosh, we're gonna need all kinds of things for these. What do we need for bio nuggets? I, I can't remember the recipes for all these things. Mushroom, silicon, and water. Let me go grab some silicon, some water. We'll make some bio nugs right now. All right, so we got some bio nugs. How many do we have? Because we need like we need one for every tree, right? Uh, and then up here we've got three, seven, so eight trees actually. And we've got three, six. We already built one, so that's seven. We need one more. And you know what? I'm not growing any mushrooms right now. Ooh, no. All right, so I guess seven's going to be the deal for us, maybe, for now. Um, we'll see if we can even get that far, because we also have to get fertilizer, tree bark, bacteria samples. Super alloy is easy. Bacteria samples should be easy. Fertilizer's kind of a pain because of the sulfur. And then tree bark. You know what? Let's actually go harvest our tree bark right now. Oh, let's check on our, our things. 100%. Okay, so this one's done already. This is at 79%, so there you go. Interesting. I like that. I like it. All right, is this thing done being sequenced? Hey, tree seed plume? Wait a second. Was that actually better than these? Yeah, because it was 200%, and these are only 150 a max. Okay, cool. Uh, hydration level low. Delicious. Let's go plant our first tree seed. Oh my goodness, this is going to be amazing. We're going to have some trees growing next to the water. Okay. Uh, okay. Okay. How long does this take? Growth, 1%. All right. 1%. 2%. Oh my gosh. This is going to take forever. You know, I'd have, I'd love to time lapse this, but I would uh, run out of oxygen and thirst and hunger. It would be cool to free cam this though and like watch this grow. 3%. It's not going to grow trees in the water, is it? That wouldn't make any sense. I feel like it I feel like it grows trees around the water. You know what I'm saying? All right, so we'll come back to that. What do we need to get more of these things going? So I started making some bacteria samples. Uh, we've got like four or five fertilizer bags. We got the bio nuggets. We got the tree bark. Um, it's the bacteria samples. It's actually the stupid water that I'm actually running low on here. Um... I don't really want to use the bio nuggets for the water, like the lake water collector. What do we need for the uh, the big air one? Iron, silicone, magnesium, aluminum, super alloy. Basically, just one of everything. We can totally do that. All right. Yeah, we got another one of those. We'll get another one of these things going. 
Uh, can we get it just like right next to this one? Can we get it like right in here? Come on, get close. Perfect. Okay. So we got two of those going. Uh, that'll get some water a little bit faster because we need it for, like I said, we need it for the, the bacteria sample cars. Three water and three algae. Algae's not even the issue. It's the water. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, I want to see these little trees. Do we have a little tree yet? Oh, <gasps> we have little trees. Oh my gosh. There's a little patch of trees right here. They're so teeny tiny. <gasps> oh, there's some over here. And over here. Wait, how far of an area did that thing reach? Is there more trees? I'm actually kind of curious. Like, can you just place it on a water thing? And like, no. Okay, it definitely looks like it. That's super weird. It looks like it's super far away. Like, I feel like this is way further away than it's supposed to be, but... They're definitely growing. Oh my gosh, they're definitely growing. I am so excited about that. We got little trees. All right, we need water. All right, we got some bacteria samples. Let's go ahead and let's throw some of those things out. So we've got uh, fertilizer, some bacteria samples. We're going to need some tree bark. And then what else do we need for this? Uh, bioplastic nuggets and super alloy. So bio nuggets, we have that super alloy. We can go grab some of those and then that will allow us to place down some more of these. And then we can focus on getting other plants. Let's look at our trees now. Oh my gosh. Look at our amazing trees. Oh, they're so cool. I love them so much. All right. We got to place one probably over here. Mm, might leave this area clear for now uh just because i don't want them like accidentally like growing up into the base or something uh so let's go ahead and put one right here maybe uh let's go ahead and throw one maybe like right in here so i'll have one there one there let's get one over here on this peninsula thing looking deal too Oh, this is so cool. The area is definitely bigger than it looks. All right, so we'll place that there. Uh, do I have enough for another one? Oh, we do. We do indeed. Uh, we'll place this one like over here, maybe. And then, okay, so that's all we've got for now. All right, so now we need to focus on the trees. So we've got the golden type tree here, which is super cool. Oh, these look super nice. I love this. This is just so amazing. It is just so amazing. 90% growth done. Oh, we got trees, people. We've got trees. Um, okay, so let's go with the next tier. So I would say let's get the uh, let's get the volness going here. Oh, you know what? We're going to need a mutagen. So sulfur and a methane cartridge. So we've got the methane but I don't have any sulfur anywhere. Unless I threw it back in here. I don't think I have any more. Oh, sulfur is always the issue right now. All right, now I have sulfur. <laughs> I got two pieces. Uh, so there's one mutagen, two mutagen. So now we just need tree bark and then the plant. All right, so let's grab tree bark. So there's the tree bark and then the plant itself. Uh, there's the Volness, and then let's see. Let's do um, the Orima one as well. So let's do uh, that, that, and that. Research. Okay. Start sequencing. Oh, this is going to be so cool. I can't wait. Oh, this is so cool. I love... Look at the trees. You can see the trees. We need to put more glass in here. We need a big, huge observatory room. So we can see all the things, the wonderful things that we've been doing here. Oh my gosh, this DNA sequencing takes forever. You know, I'm sure in the uh, the grand scheme of things, I feel like, you know, oh, we're just minorly changing the DNA of a plant. Probably takes a lot longer than the, the couple minutes that I have to sit here and wait, so I can't complain too much. Uh, but then we're going to go ahead and we're going to immediately do um, this one as well. So we can have, oh, we can have all the plants growing, all of the trees. Look at these wonderful trees. Oh, they're super cool. 
They are super cool. I feel like we're actually like walking through a forest now. Like this is cool. I like them. Now I'm curious because like I said, like that seems a lot further out here than what it showed. And I'm wondering if like now that we're putting these trees on, if there's going to be a possibility to get trees elsewhere. I don't know. Probably not. I feel like it's probably going to be, uh, you know, relatively close to where you where you place the machines. Um, I mean, we do have those uh, those like some trees that are just like randomly generated, but they're not like everywhere right now. And it's done. OK, so let's go ahead and get this. Oh, wait, hold on. It's bark. Then that then that research and start sequencing okay so let's go ahead and let's go place our new tree should we place it over here or over here let's place it over here because i feel like these are gonna be the cool looking trees um all right so tree seed amora and we basically just have to let it sit and grow and we got another tree seed yes humalora Humalora. Okay. Uh, you know what? Where should we put this one? Oh, there's those ones. Let's put this one on the peninsula over here. I feel like this peninsula needs a little bit of needs a little bit of tree coverage. You know what I'm saying? All right. So let's get that there. Let's go look at these trees. So all the trees look pretty different, and it looks like they groups they grow in groups of like three, four, or five. Oh, they're kind of like a palm tree. Look at oh, I like it. Oh, that's super cool. That's super cool. All right, let's wait this rain rainstorm out here. Jeez. All right, now we can really appreciate these trees here. Oh, yeah, looking pretty good. See, they're growing way out there. And then how far out are these ones growing? So these ones aren't growing out here nearly as far. And then those ones we haven't done anything with. How's this one looking? Is this one doing anything yet? <gasps> oh, I see something. I see a little teeny tiny something. I don't know why, but trees are just amazing. <laughs> it's just so cool. But that's going to end this episode. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed it. If you did, like, subscribe, all fun things. Um, I think next episode, we're going to try to get maybe the rest of the trees. And then let me see what we have left to unlock here. Because as far as I know, we've got the tree spreader tier 2. Uh, we've got tree spreader tier 3, which those... These are within like relative, you know, we could we could relatively unlock this 79.5. Oh, that's a lot. But this being 578, I don't know that we're going to necessarily mess with that or not. We'll have to see. Uh, maybe I'll just let this run and try to make a video over this thing specifically because there's not really a whole lot left for us to do here. Um, but also, like I said, we do have some mini videos coming out. Also, I do have a video over uh, coming out soon over starting locations. And I think we might be starting a fresh new save in an area that I did not know you could spawn in. So, uh, yeah, maybe, maybe we'll have to see. But, yeah, thanks again for coming out. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, like, subscribe, all the fun things. If you want to get more social, other social links down below. We got the Twitter. We got the Discord. We got all the fun places to hang out, do the fun things. Uh, we've always got Twitch. But, uh, yeah, thanks again for coming out. Have a wonderful day. I'll see you next time.